Well, hi, guys. It's that time. It's our Bible teaching snippet of the day. Well, today I want to go back to uh, my travels last week when I went to uh, Kentucky and in Indiana. Uh, I'm going to go over to Monday morning. I went to a church building, and I thought we were doing a Bible study, but quite honestly, it kind of turned out that we just had Monday morning church. Uh, the worship leader, which, by the way, well, I don't know if she's the worship leader, but this lady was uh, playing the piano and singing, and oh, my goodness, she is su has such a wonderful voice. She is so talented, and she actually sang two of my most favorite worship songs. Uh, so uh, after the uh, lady pastor got through uh, teaching out of Acts for quite a while, we called people up for healing. So here's my story I want to go in today. We, and this lady uh, didn't come up immediately or anything. In fact, I don't even know if she would have gotten up for healing if it hadn't been for her friend. So I'm walking around, you know, worshiping God because I don't have anybody standing in front of me wanting prayer. So I'm just worshiping. And uh, the lady got my attention and waved for me, and I came over. And she said, I, I need you to pray for my friend. And I said, oh, absolutely. So as I uh, headed to the lady, and before I could uh, walk up and ask her what she needed, uh, Holy Spirit just told me, reach out your hand, take her by the hand. So I reached out and I took her by her hand, okay? And when I touched her, he told me, he said, wrap her up in your arms and hug her. Now look, I've hugged people before because hugging is a thing of God. God, people need that. People need to feel the love of God through human touch sometimes. So, okay, so I wrap her in my arms and then Holy Spirit says, dance with her. And, and, of course, you know, this is new. I, I've, I've never, honestly, guys, I don't, not that I know of, I don't recall ever hearing him tell me just to start dancing with someone. But I did. Hey, that's what he asked me to do. And I just said, well, let's dance. Now, while I had her hugged up, just holding her, I said, let's dance. And I started just slow dancing with this lady. And she was a little bit older, okay? Uh, so I'm just dancing with her to this wonderful, wonderful worship song. Uh, and all of a sudden, Holy Spirit starts downloading stuff to me. And I told her, I said, he just wants to dance with you. This is not me dancing with you. This is the Lord. He said he wanted to dance with you. And this sweet, sweet woman starts crying. And she says, Oh, my goodness, I love to dance. I've always loved to dance, and I haven't been able to in so many years. I get dizzy, and I fall down, and I fell three times lately, and that's what I wanted you to pray for me about is so I wouldn't lose my balance and fall anymore. And I told her, I said, Honey, you are not going to fall anymore because he's going to heal you while we dance. Baby, he's healing you right now. That is so awesome. Guys, you have no idea how just precious that is. That Because I know nothing about this lady. I didn't even know her name. And Holy Spirit knew. Remember, I told you yesterday that Holy Spirit knows exactly what a person needs. And he pulls that out of me when I'm working with him, just like her. And I don't restrict him. If he tells me to uh, sit down at somebody's feet and rub their feet, which I've done that. He told me one time, sit at this person's feet and do nothing but rub their feet. And as I did, uh, the lady told me it felt like that I was pulling the pain out of her waist all the way down her legs and out the, the tips of her toes. And I had never done that before. So I don't restrict Holy Spirit. You know what? Whatever he tells me to do, I'm just going to do it because he knows that that is what the person that he's trying to heal will respond to. So this beautiful, beautiful woman and I slow danced together, and it was him slow dancing with her. Well, listen, guys, I know this is a short little video today. But I just wanted to share that with you. And even though it's short, I got to tell you, it's going down in my ledger, my little journal of healings. 
because that was one of the most precious healings that I have ever, ever experienced is to know that I'm actually healing someone through the power of God by blessing her heart and giving her something that her little heart has desired for so long is to be able to dance again. And she got that that day. So listen, I'm going to hop off here. God bless you, and I will see you here tomorrow. Bye-bye.